Alright gamers, sorry about the crash. Um, what we need to do now... I think I've already went, yeah, it's their turn, so we'll see what they're going to do. Is we really need to, since it's a strategy game and they like to fuck you in the last turn, we need to push our guys up and hold as many spots as possible. Hopefully we can push them back and hold it with some good artillery fire. And keep the points, the hexes. Let's see, so what do we need to hit first? Strongest unit is that guy. Let's hit him again. And then who's annoying me over here? That unit looks annoying. Alright, so what are we doing over here? Let's see if we can push this guy away. That unit is definitely not going to. Pickett's not going to do anything. Oh, excellent. See, again, we take another little spot there. Let's see, seven, seven. Will you fight? You will? Excellent. Let's move you up. Long Street, we'll put you right there. I don't like that sharpshooter unit. They're annoying the hell out of me. Yes, I want you to retreat. And we're going to put you right there. Let's dig in and play... Well, I don't want to play too conservative. But then again... Okay, he's not going to fight. I don't want to play too conservative, but then again, I want to also make sure that I can cripple them to where they won't be able to do stuff. Yes, do stuff. That is very, very good let's play horrific material there that I just said. Um, let's put you guys in formation so we can dig you in next turn. Because, like, what's happened on most games is I'll attack them and push them back and then they'll be able to push me back and take all the flags and then they get all the victory points which if I bring up the victory points here you can see some of these on the front are worth a lot and it can really lopside the battle so I'm gonna try to make sure that doesn't happen alright so I think that's all of my guys that can go so let's save let's save as um, after crash Oh, after 24. There we go. That'll work. Get rid of that. And let's let them go and let them hit me with what they got. I just gotta keep resupplying my, enem my, my enemies. No, I don't want to resupply my enemies. SKS, God, let's say it. I'm a dumbass. I think I will eat some Chinese or Japanese food today. That sounds really good to me. Let's hit this group. They look like they've got resupplied way too much. And I don't like that one bit. Ooh, we wounded their leader. Your leader. Excellent. At ease, man. At ease, man. I see, they'll probably take that flag here in a minute. Let's, let's give you all half supply. Alright, now see, I attacked him and put him out in the open. So, let's dig in here. Johnson, you need to move there. Actually, Longstreet, I would like you to move there just to give us some backup. So our line won't bulge is what I'm kind of going for here, if that makes any sense. How much is that victory hex worth? Because I don't know if it's worth it or not. I decided that it was worth it. So 
See, if I make it to where my guys can't really retreat, maybe we'll be able to hold the line. Ooh, let's hopscotch here. Maybe we can push him back. Ah, oh, fuck! Let's protect the flank here. Let's move them up just to uh, be a distraction for some of these guys. everybody. Alright, so let's save for crashes and hit turn. Oh, I thought they was bringing in the cavalry to attack. Oh shit, they might be getting ready to hit the flank up there. I think teachers make the best generals. That's what I'm going to say. Because you can teach your men what in the hell they need to do and they're more observant because they're used to looking for stuff. Then again, I say that and I'm Hold the line, boys. Shit. Alright, last turn. This is where we need to make sure... Fuck. Why can't you guys have artillery rounds? No! I hit the wrong... Fuck that. I wanted to hit this guy. That pisses me off. Man. Let's let everybody dig in. Man. What is that spot worth? 10, 12. Not really a big turn. Not when if I lose that one, it's worth a lot more. That one pissed me off, though. They reform, but they can't go anywhere. Yes, move them off that spot. Fuck! There you go. That's what I wanted. I gotta hit this unit, because if they attack that one that's just sitting there, we're in trouble. Maybe now I can keep them from both going through there. Maybe now they'll be too worried about uh, turning those flags. That's what I'm hoping, anyway. This unit's probably going to get surrounded and killed. Damn it. Why can't you guys do what I want? Don't you all know it's the last turn of the battle? Hold the line, guys. You've got to hold it. pick it up here so he feels like he's part of it. Alright, let's save as N7. I don't know why it says 7D. 7. I'm hitting the N key. There we go. I don't... Uh, I don't know. Alright, let's see. If, let's hope we can hold some of these spots. Good job, guys. No! Come on, boys. I thought they might actually get that one. Oh, you fucktards. Taking that back one. Well, yeah, big deal there. Oh, yeah, that was a good decoy. I'm glad that happened. Yes, I want to save the game. Where was it? N7. A draw? Are you serious? Well... I guess. Men killed, roughly the same. Men wounded, roughly the same. We had a leader killed, two wounded, they had one wounded. They had 2,000 men surrender. Supply capture. 
44,000. I captured more supply. I took a whole lot more weapon cost. That'd be some valuable upgrades. Victory points is about the same. And uh, victory points, you know, overall. I, t I don't see how that's possible. Look at the difference, gamers. 8,000, almost 9,000 to 40. We almost doubled up on them. We probably had to double up on them to win. Shit. Oh well. Serious but improving. Serious, fully recovering. So we lost barefoot. Wade Hampton. Oh, come on, Hampton. All right, you all can read through that if you want. Let's go over here and equip our soldiers. Thirty-eight. We definitely need to increase you. Thirty-eight to fifty-four is a hell of an upgrade. Um, give you some better hand-to-hand. -hand. Let's see. Uh, there's no middleman there. Okay. Long Streets Division. Yeah, we gotta definitely get these guys up some. Uh, let's move you to the Napoleons. Sharpshooters, upgrade them. Gotta get my boys where they can handle a fight. Let's see what else we have here. Definitely need to upgrade there. Man, I really wish I could afford that upgrade. And we'll just leave those. I might actually do it for our upgrade department. No, we can get them up there a little bit. Alright. So, we're complete, and where are we heading? The Battle of Mechanicsville, Alternate 3. Stonewall Jackson arrives in time for Beaver Dam and flanks McCall. McDowell is released from the defense of Washington and comes to McCall's rescue. The rebels should take advantage of Stonewall Jackson's early arrival time to flank McCall's troops. Alright, so we need to remember that. The Union should try to hold the Rebels back by massing artillery fire until their reinforcements arrive. If they can hold their ground, McDowell's forces should be able to make some, take some pressure off McCall. In the second of seven days battles, Robert E. Lee, who assumed command of the Rebel Army after the Battle of Seven Pines, tried to use the Chickamauga River to his advantage. Lee sent John Magruder with 25,000 men to make a feint at the 60,000 Federals on the southern bank. With the intervention of using his main army to overwhelm Fitz, John Porter's 30,000 man force isolated to the north bank. Due to the slowness of Stonewall Jackson's exhausted men, Porter easily repelled the attack. Well, we need to make sure that that doesn't happen. But next time, gamers, we will play the Battle of Mechanicsville Alternate 3. See you next time.